Hello everybody! How are we today? Let me refresh this real quick. Looks like we got about two minutes. There we go. Hope everybody's doing well today. All right. Hey. Okay. Hello, it's Kara. Miss Kara from the Mountainburg Public Library. Hope everybody is doing well today. You are going to do a craft today and then we're going to read a story. So I have, as the material is stated, we'll make our own DIY binoculars. I think I'll put mine on. Okay. Do it yourself binoculars. And I'm I'm telling you, these these really they work. They so, as the instructions said, you needed whoops, two paper tubes, tissue paper tubes, paper towel, toilet paper, whichever, okay? You needed a um, glue gun. If you are a um, child, please only use the glue gun under adult supervision. We don't want anybody to have any burned fingers or anything like that. I have my uh, washi tape, which is the paper tape. I grabbed electrical tape. I grabbed masking tape. You can use any kind of tape, any kind of tape. I have a piece of string, a piece of yarn that is long enough for our um, strap for our binoculars. And, and then you can throw in if you wanted to. Well, we'll get there. We'll get there. Let's start with step one. We're going to connect these together. Okay. So I'm going to take my glue gun and I'm going to run a, I am going to, I'm going to run a strip of glue down one side of one of my rolls. Okay. And then I'm going to stick those together. Oh, hello, Greta May. Hello, Sarah. So glad you guys joined us today. Good deal. Okay. So there, and now you've got them. And if you don't have a glue gun, don't fret. You can use the washi tape to just get them to stay together and that'll work. I found that the hot glue gun, hello Sarah, the hot glue gun worked the best and the fastest. So once you have these stuck together, then sky's the limit. You can decorate these with um, markers. You can decorate these with, uh, of course, the washi tape. Um, you can, if you want to still use the hot glue gun, you could hot glue gun pom-poms to them. You can make, just design them and have them be whatever you want it to be. So I'm going to put a couple pieces of the washi tape on here. Okay. You just take it out and just wrap it around. So we're just going to wrap it around. Okay. Then maybe I want to take a green marker. I want to make stars on mine. Stars are great. Because you know what? Be a star. Be a star every day. Okay. So once you have them connected and decorated to your liking, you are going to take, again, under adult supervision, children out there, you're going to take either a pair of scissors or 
If you have a uh, one hole punch, this will work perfect. And what we're gonna do is we're going to make the holes for our strap. So we're gonna do one on that one, and we're gonna do one on that side. So then you've got a hole there and a hole there. And now I'm gonna take my nifty piece of string or yarn or whatever it was that you had that was handy. And I'm going to tie, place it through the hole and just tie a knot. Just tie a knot. We don't have to be fancy. These are to, to have fun and be used and explore, okay? So then we're gonna go ahead and we're going to tie, we're gonna put the other end of the string through the other hole and we're gonna tie another knot on the other side, okay? Then, the best part about this is you get to then start an adventure. Go outside if it's not raining. It's not raining here anymore. It's a gorgeous day. And look around. Try and find some new stuff. And if you followed along and you made your own binoculars, it would be wonderful if you would show Miss Kara, take a picture of your project. You can put it in the comments down below. And um, I would love to see it. I miss everybody. Um, so we did our craft, which was super fast and super easy. Um, if there were any questions, please, you can go ahead and you can ask me now or you can ask me later, whichever you like. Um, but now I wanted to go ahead and I wanted to read one of my most favorite books. So everybody can take their binoculars and later today, go on a bear hunt. Just in your backyard. Just walk through your neighborhood. Stay, your, use your social distancing. Stay safe. Always stay safe. Okay? So now we're going to go. That concludes our craft. Our crafting with Miss Kara. Now we're going to go ahead and we're going to read... We're going on a bear hunt. And I'm pretty sure that I had the setting done correctly, but if somebody could send me a quick little message and let me know that you can read that and that it's not backwards, that would be great. Okay? So we're gonna read We're Going on a Bear Hunt by Michael Rosen and Helen Oxenbury. It's such a good book. Okay. And the artwork. Artwork is just gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. We're going on a bear hunt. <gasps> We're going on a bear hunt. Okay. <gasps> We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Oh, grass, long, wavy grass. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Swishy, swashy, swishy, swashy, swishy, swashy through the grass. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Oh no, a river, a deep cold river. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Thank you, Ariel. Splish, splosh. Splash, splosh, splash, splosh, splash, splosh. <gasps> Through the river they go. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Oh, mud, 
thick, oozy mud. Can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we have to go through it. Squelch, squirch. Squelch, squirch. Squelch, squirch. You know the magnificent sound that mud makes on your shoes. I love it. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Oh no, a forest. A big dark forest. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Stumble trip, stumble trip, stumble trip. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Oh no, a snowstorm, a swirling, whirling snowstorm. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we must go through it. This is getting scary. That's what a snowstorm sounds like. <laughs> We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Uh, oh, a cave, a narrow, gloomy cave. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. We've got to go through it. Tiptoe, tiptoe, tiptoe. <gasps> What's that? One shiny wet nose, two big furry ears, two big goggly eyes. <gasps> it's a bear! <gasps> but they were on a bear hunt, right? Right? <gasps> Quick, back through the cave. Tiptoe, tiptoe, tiptoe. <gasps> oh my gosh! <gasps> back through the snowstorm. <sighs> Maybe that was more realistic. <laughs> Back through the forest. Stumble trip, stumble trip, stumble trip. <gasps> Back through the mud. Squelch, 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 squelch. <gasps> Back through the river. Splash, 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 splash. And. Oops. Back through the grass. Swishy, swashy, swishy, swashy. Get to our front door. Open the door. Up the stairs. Oh no, we forgot to shut the door. Back downstairs. Shut the door. Back upstairs and into bed. Into the bedroom. Into bed. Under the covers. We're not going on a bear hunt. Again. Beautiful. So, the end. That is the end of We're Going on a Bear Hunt. If anybody is interested, call me and you are welcome to check it out. Um, couple things. Thank you, first and foremost, for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed it. The binoculars are super easy. Um, the littlest can make them and, and it, just be careful with that hot glue gun. Okay. Okay. Um, if you did indeed follow along and make your own binoculars, I would love to see. So please post me a picture. You can post it in the comments below. 
Um, you can post it to the Mountainburg Facebook page, whichever you'd like to do. Um, I would love to see it. I'd love to see it. Uh, we are currently working out the details on our summer reading program, and we'll be getting all of that information out to you as soon as we can. Um, we're looking forward to it. It's going to be it's going to be really fun. Miss Kara's looking forward to it. So um, stay tuned. We're also working on a schedule to get um, some programming done um, digitally. So you'll be seeing um, more of Miss Kara. So I, I hope you like it as much as I do. So um, again, thank you for joining me today. Um, be safe. Be healthy. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Miss Allison. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you, Ariel and kids and everybody else that watched. Thank you, thank you. Be safe, be healthy, and always remember to have fun. Until next time, see you guys.